Dude. Wow. There's Corbin over there talking to his camera. Yeah, buddy. Uh, Corbin and I just got uh, all checked in here at the ranger station. We are headed uh, to the other parking lot where we're going to leave my truck and we'll be out for a couple days. So, and have a great time. Uh, we are at the trailhead, just getting our packs on and uh, heading into the Candylands. A new area for me, so looking forward to having a good two nights, three days. And it's my first backpacking trip for like two months. That's cool. Lighting. Uh, you guys are gonna hear me say this a lot, but this is just incredible, unbelievable. So pretty. Uh, you saw my good friend Corbin already with me. I've never been to this area, so luckily he's kind of being my tour guide this trip and uh, looking forward to just having a really good time together. <laughs> Super excited. Uh, we're here. Corbin's just around the bend. We're in an established campsite in the area. I'm going to throw down on this pad right behind me. Uh, we both have incredible views of the canyon behind us. Check this out. That is my view. guys I just got all set up for tonight um, as far as uh, shelter I brought my REI quarter dome one person because it's a freestanding tent and there's not really a good ground to put stakes into I got my zero degree uh, outdoor vital summit bag which is probably a little overkill we're expecting temperatures maybe as low as 25 so should be very comfortable so I should be very comfortable tonight and uh, I brought my insulated Nemo tensor sleeping pad so gonna have a good night but Awesome place to set up, and I'm going to go uh, check on Corbin, and uh, we should have an awesome, awesome time in here. So. Good morning. Uh, it's about 10 after 5 in the morning. 
I've actually been awake since like three. Um, slept really good from probably ten to three. And since then, I've just been watching a you know a movie on my phone and just relaxing. Uh, right now, I've just got some tunes on. I'm actually going to get some coffee going in my vestibule and uh, see if we can't catch a, a sunrise here in an hour or so. So, looking forward to another great day out here. warmed my tent right up. Ooh, nothing like this. Nothing like the smell of fresh coffee in the morning. Okay, Corbin's quite a ways ahead of me now, but <laughs> uh, we're packed up, headed up to Druid Arch, and uh, looking forward to having a really good day. So we'll get on the trail, catch up to Corbin. Yeah. Did you wet stuff in the van? Uh, we are uh, working our way down from Druid Arch. We're gonna stop at this little pool right behind us and uh, filter some water. We're both pretty low. We drank our water, uh, what we brought up on the arch with our coffee, so. You got your cap open all the way? All right, 30 minutes later and we are done filtering water. Uh, what are the chances uh, Corbin and I's, both of our Sawyer squeezes uh, are pretty much garbage. My flow rate was none. I couldn't back flush it. His flow rate's garbage. So uh, Hydro Blue, here I come. All right, we are just coming out of Elephant Canyon on our way over to Chesler, about an eighth of a mile. Do some exploring over there. That's the first time that I've ever been there, and I believe Corbin's first time over there, so we're, we're kind of excited about seeing something new. Yes, this is all new to me. So beautiful everywhere. Uh, we've just made it into uh, Chesler Park and uh, we're gonna go find cowboy camp. So we're just up here, I uh, made it to the cowboy camp. We're both super psyched, such a neat, uh, just a really special area that I've wanted to see for a long, long time. Finally here and uh, really, really happy to be here with my good buddy. All right guys, we are uh, finished up our coffee. I almost took a nap. I was really close to falling asleep. 
laying down at the old cowboy camp and uh, we're gonna work our way back to our camp. Been a long day, gonna have some dinner and uh, just relax the rest of the day and probably get an early out, so. Oh, all right guys, we are back at camp. Been a long day, we did about eight hours on the trail, uh, probably around nine miles. So we kind of boogied back to camp after Tressler Park Chesler Park. Uh, it started to sprinkle on us, but it didn't last long, and it should be a, a really relaxing, you know, the rest of the day should be really nice. So I'm going to go, uh, my chair's over by Corbin, and we're going to go hang out and probably have an early dinner and uh, an early bed. So. In smell of darting rain, she moves my with her fame. She is the star, the call. Wow. All right, so I'm just kind of getting some dry, comfortable clothes on in my tent, probably for the night. It's pretty early, uh, 6.30 or so, but it's been a long day, and, um, you know, both Corbin and I are pretty tired, and I've got a couple movies on my phone. I'm going to put a movie on my little hang time hook right there and uh, watch a movie or two, and then go to bed. So uh, we'll see you all in the morning. Oh, good morning. Had a great night. Uh, was in the tent for 10 or 12 hours. Uh, got a lot of really good sleep. Definitely made up for the last night. But both Corbin and I are packed up and uh, we're going to hike out of here. So, been an incredible trip. First backpacking trip of the season and uh, here's to many more to come. So, we'll see you guys soon.